Fly with me to Corfu, Greece, 2024. This is one of my best friends of 20 years, and as you can see, she's absolutely buzzing. We flew with Jet2 Holidays, first time, won't be the last. Absolutely brilliant experience. Bit of red wine to calm the nerves. Dramatic shot looking out the window, gotta be done. Smooth flying, no turbulence. Another dramatic shot. Real clear sky, uh, views upon views upon views. That's the Alps if anybody's interested. As you can see, we arrived safely at Cook's Club Corfu. The reason the hotel was so empty is because we arrived on the Easter weekend. So essentially, we pretty much had the whole hotel to ourselves from the Friday to the Sunday before the uh, big kickoff of the new season begun on April the 1st. This is our first morning waking up in Corfu. The sun was shining. As you can see, Claire looks absolutely buzzing about getting out. As you can see, absolutely stunning facilities. Look at that pool. Look at that sun. This walking path on the hotel grounds was absolutely beautiful, very dreamy. We were very lucky with the weather as it had been raining the week leading up to us arriving. I had never seen a hotel with so much seating area. So this is the Saturday and there's only a handful of guests in the hotel. So again, we pretty much just chilled by the pool, enjoyed the sun. Then we went out into Corfu Old Town for some dinner and we were recommended by some staff at the hotel, this amazing spot, Margarita Pizza. And trust me when I tell you, the wine and the pizza was stunning. This was Easter Sunday, celebrating my birthday. Then we went back into Corfu Old Town for some dinner. We were recommended this incredible restaurant called Rex by some staff at the hotel once again. I had some spag bowl and a free dessert for my birthday, did a bit of content, then went for a massage. This is the second pool and outdoor bar at the hotel. We never actually did swim in this pool. This was our fine dining dinner at the hotel. More red wine, Greek salad. This is the view surrounding the hotel. Absolutely beautiful. And this is me just taking it all in before flying back home. And once again, we had a nice smooth flight home and landed at Stansted Airport in the UK. And here are some pics of us looking our best selves and living our best life.